Hello everyone and welcome to this fight night video brought to you by James from MySmarterHome.com My fight night series of videos contain comparisons of popular smart devices and to make it more light hearted I use a boxing match format. The two devices that are fighting in today's video are the Skybell HD and the August Cam and these are two smart video doorbells or Wi-Fi video doorbells. In this comparison I've collected as many details as I could about each product and I've broken the details down into short sections which make up my boxing rounds. This fight contains nine rounds and after each round I will tell you who in my opinion has won and at the end of the whole comparison I will declare an overall winner. So here we have a photo of the Skybell HD and the August doorbell cam. Now I don't want to tell you which of these locks, sorry, which of these doorbells I like the look of the most because I think that the look and design of a product is something that is down to personal taste. What all my videos tend to focus on is instead the cold hard facts of specifications and technical details. So let's jump straight into round one the basic specifications. So firstly, who are these doorbells made by? Well, Skybell is a company in its own right, as is August, and they, they are companies who have set up in recent years and they are beginning to make more and more smart gadgets or smart, smart devices. In terms of when the product was launched, when it was first sold, the Skybell was launched in April 2016, whereas the August was launched in and first for sale first in October 2015. In terms of weight, the Skybell is 1.9 ounces, whereas August is 13.9 ounces. So there's quite a difference there. The August is a much heavier device. And then dimensions, well, they're, they're pretty similar here. Um, the Skybell is 2.8 by 0.9 by 2.8 inches, whereas the August is 3.4 by 3.4 by 2.2 inches. And so the August is a slightly bigger um, doorbell. In terms of prices, and it's important to remember that these prices do change on quite a regular basis, but at the moment the August you can get for about $174, whereas the Skybell is $195. So again, the August is just over $20 cheaper. So at the end of round one, who do I think has won that? I think that it is the August doorbell cam who's won that because of its great price fundamentally. Okay let's have a look at round two quite a lot of different features here for the videos so let's go through them so for the resolution the Skybell is giving you a 1080p resolution in the videos whereas the August is giving you a 960p resolution so the Skybell is shooting videos in higher quality Field of vision, well the Skybell has a field of vision and remember the field of vision is how much in front of the camera can the camera actually see. So the field of vision for this Skybell is 130 degrees whereas the August is giving you 120 degrees. So the Skybell has just a marginally better field of vision. Audio, they are both two-way and what this means is that the person at your front door can talk into the, the doorbell and then you can talk back to them. So they both offer two-way audio and communication. Both of these doorbells have night vision. The Skybell uh, has night vision and it says that it's up to 15 feet. The August uses a slightly different technology, it uses low light technology which it produces colour pictures even at night. So that's quite interesting. The Skybell, uh, yes you can live stream and you can do that via the app 
and also the August you can live stream and you can see that via the app. Other smart doorbells do offer live streaming via a, a browser as well. And then finally the last video feature is motion detection and the Skybell and the August both offer motion detection and they also offer have sensitivity settings which means that you can change the sensitivity on the motion detection from low to medium or to high depending on your different circumstances. So at the end of round two I think it's the Skybell HD because it's got a great resolution and a slightly better field of vision. Round three remote access this is all about the apps that these devices use that you can use on your smartphones and your tablets so the Skybell has an app and if you're using an iPhone or an iPad it you require uh, iOS 8 or later whereas the August if you're for your iPhone or your iPad you require iOS 9 or later in terms of your Android devices so this is your your Galaxy tablets perhaps or your um, Nexus phones then the Skyball requires you to have version 4.4 of Android or later and it's the same for the August cam you require version 4.4 or later to run their app on your phone or your tablet and then Windows 10 neither of these two offer a Windows 10 app for your mobile your Windows 10 mobile device so let's move on to the how the apps are rating what I've done here is I've gone into the app stores and seen just what users think about each of these individual apps so for the 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 iOS app for the Skybell it's got five ratings which is pretty low actually but they give it five out of five and again for, for its iOS app the August has seven ratings so slightly more ratings and it's given five out of five now on the Google Play Store for the rating for the Android app we have got um, for the Skybell it has been rated 617 times and it's got three stars out of five whereas the August app on the Google Play Store has been rated 959 times and it's 2.8 stars out of 5. So the, the ratings themselves on the Android are pretty similar but of course the August has a lot more ratings and since neither of them have Windows 10 apps the ratings on the Windows Store is irrelevant. So at the end of round 3 let's have a look I think round three is although it's very similar between the devices the August doorbell cam wins it the Skybell uses an older version of iOS which is good because it means you can use it on slightly more devices but the August has more ratings round four now this is all about can you rem remotely access these doorbells via your browser and for some doorbells you you can do this they will give you access to the doorbell uh, via your browsers but neither the Skybell or the August allow any um, access via browsers you just have to do it via either the iOS app or the Android app so for each of these in terms of the browser access it's no for the Firefox, for Internet, for Chrome or for Safari or indeed any other browser. So because of that at the end of round four this is a draw. Round five home automation now this is a big big and important issue for these devices. So what I've done is I've looked at some of the most frequent home automation systems and seeing how these two doorbells um, if they are compatible with them so first of all is IFTTT if this then that 
and the Skybell has its own official channel um, on IFTTT and it's got 17 recipes and that basically recipes are just different ways of managing and controlling the device. The August has no official channel on IFTTT so it's not it's not that compatible with with those systems next amazon echo um, using ifttt the skybell hd is compatible with the amazon echo system but the august doorbell cam isn't compatible at the moment at all with the echo system next is homekit this is apple's um, automation system for the home Skybell HD is not compatible with it whereas August is then another big system is Z-Wave and neither the Skybell or August are compatible with with Z-Wave nor Zigbee which is another huge home automation system so neither the Skybell nor August are compatible with them um, Wink it doesn't uh, again neither of these devices are compatible with the Wink home automation systems and finally we've got Samsung smart things and here the Skybell HD is compatible with it whereas August isn't and what I've done here is the winner of round five I've put as the August doorbell cam and the reason for this is because of the importance of the Apple home kit compatibility Round six, connection and storage. So here we've got both devices connect using Wi-Fi, the 2.4 gigahertz standard. Um, Bluetooth, the August works with Bluetooth, but the Skybell doesn't. Neither of these two um, devices are connect, can be connected via an Ethernet cable. And then in terms of storage, um, Skybell HD uses cloud storage, which is free at the moment. Whereas for the August, it's their, their storage is free for the first 30 days, then it's $4.99 per month after that. So after round six, I think my winner is the Skybell HD. It's a close call, but because of their free storage, I think it comes out as a winner. Round seven, power. Now, these doorbells can be powered in a variety of ways. Um, some use 110 volts, just like a mains cable, to power it. Um, a lot of them use 16 volts to 24 volts. This is your tr traditional low voltage, also called doorbell wire. And then finally, another method of powering some of these smart doorbells is by battery but the Skybell and the August both use the doorbell wire to be powered so at the end of round seven I've called that a draw because the way that they're powered is essentially the same round eight design and warranty and here we go we've got let's start off with the color the Skybell comes in two colors silver and bronze and the August also comes in two colors silver and dark gray the next feature of the design is weatherproofing both of them are, are weatherproofed um, and the operating temperatures of the Skybell HD is minus 40 degrees C to 65 degrees C whereas for the August it is minus 25 degrees C to 50 degrees C and so they're pretty well in fact the Skybell's got much better kind of an operating temperature much wider operating temperature the next feature is all about compatibility with smart locks and the Skybell HD is compatible with the Quickset Kivo whereas the August is compatible with another product made by the same company their own smart lock so they're pretty equal in terms of their smart lock compatibility 
And for the final thing, final feature that I'm looking at is warranty. Skybell HD comes with free lifetime replacements. If for any reason your doorbell is stolen and you then produce a crime report and report it to the police and you send that report off to Skybell, then they will offer you a free replacement. Whereas for the August doorbell cam, the warranty is just a straight year. So round nine, sorry, round eight, who who wins that? And my winner is the Skybell. It, again, another close call, but I think because of the warranty is much is much stronger. Round nine, the final round, reviews and ratings. So let's have a look here. And of course, these reviews and ratings, like the prices for the product, do change over time. Although they'll tend, the general trends tend to stay the same. So, looking at the overall rating at the moment for the Skybell, it's 3.6 out of 5 stars, whereas the August is 2.9 out of 5 stars. So the Skybell has a has a stronger rating, a significantly stronger rating. In terms of the number of reviews written, well, the Skybell's had 559 reviews written and the August is 313 reviews written. In terms of questions asked and answered, the Skybell has 159 questions and the most popular question has been voted for seven times, whereas the August has 64 questions that have been answered and the most popular has been voted for 10 times. So again, the Skybell is significantly stronger in that area. The next feature is what percentage of all the reviews have given the product a five star rating? For the Skybell, that is 47%, whereas for the August, it's 50% of all of its written reviews have graded it as five star. So that's a pretty similar percentage there for both products and then the percentage of all the ratings that have graded the product as one star Skybell it is 21% and then August it is 24% so again pretty similar although the Skybell has a better better rating than that so let's have a look who have I decided won round nine I think it's a Skybell HD it's got a better overall rating higher number of reviews and more questions answered. And now for the overall winner is the Skybell HD. The Skybell HD won four rounds, the August won three rounds and two of the rounds were drawn. So the Skybell wins it by a whisker. These are two great Wi-Fi video door doorbells that closely match each other in many areas of performance. But if you are stuck between which one to buy between the two. Looking at the specifications, I would say go with the Skybell HD Wi-Fi video doorbell. Thank you for watching.